heard Cinco de Mayo is coming up. Yeah, I wonder what the holiday actually means. Cinco de Mayo is Spanish for the 5th of May. The holiday celebrates Mexico's victory over France in the Battle of Puebla. The Battle of Puebla was a battle between 4,000 Mexican soldiers who defeated 8,000 French soldiers. Celebrations for Cinco de Mayo include dancing, eating, and parades. Popular foods to eat on Cinco de Mayo are mole mole poblano, flan, and various refreshing beverages. Both people in Mexico and the United States celebrate this holiday. It's important to remember Cinco de Mayo is not Mexico's Independence Day. Have a great Cinco de Mayo. Good morning, Golden Eagles. Today is May 2nd and it is a beautiful blue day. My name is Maddox. And I'm Elida. And, and you're, you're watching, watching Gem TV. TV. You're watching Gem TV. This is Gem TV. This is Gem TV. You're watching Gem TV. You're watching Gem TV. The FFA plant sale is this Friday and Saturday, May 6th and 7th. Friday, 2.30 p.m. to 6 p.m. and Saturday, 9 a.m. to 1. For more information or if you have any questions, please email Christine Anderson. Hey, did you know Teacher Appreciation Week is this week? No, I didn't. And I bet you didn't either. Hello, I'm here with Gem TV, and this week is Teacher Appreciation Week. Who's your favorite teacher and why? Um, probably Mr. Schneider. He's just a really cool teacher. It's so tough. Um, Pringle, because Pringle lets me call him Pring. Mr. Ganger, because he is a fun teacher, and no offense to anyone else, but basically he is fun and charismatic. My favorite teacher, uh, Mr. Summers. Schlack, because I'm taller than him, and he's pretty cool. Miss Smith. Miss Smith, all right. Yeah, she's cool. Uh, I think my favorite teacher has to be Miss Dunham. She's always like super nice and loves like chatting with me. Definitely. Probably has to be Mr. Finstwin, because overall he's probably the nicest teacher in the school. Really chill. It sucks that he teaches health, because that means you only get him for like one semester. So yeah, but he has to be my favorite. Uh, Mr. Tripp, because he comes to all my sporting events and he's just a good dude. Lamphere. Over in Library A. Um, probably Smack Yeah, just because he's like really chill and nice. Toretta, plus I went, I like just with vet science and stuff in FFA, I've hung out with him a lot, so yeah, they're both really good. Uh, Shimmick, because he's chill. Um, uh, I'd say Davis. Because he's chill and funny. Miss Perry, because she's really nice and I like her a lot. <laughs> what about you? Uh, probably Mr. Carlson. He always has candy and he's super nice. So. Awesome. And then how about you? Who's your favorite teacher and why? Um, probably Miss Schlichting. Uh, Mr. Sampson because, uh, you know, he does all the wood shop classes and the carpentry and construction classes and he's just like a teacher you can like talk with, you know? Um, probably Mr. Morvick. Uh, he gives us lots of opportunities to be better as a person. Uh, right now my favorite teacher is definitely Caswell. She is really funny to be in the class with. Miss Stockmore, she's insanely passionate about what she does, and she's very chaotic. Uh, my favorite teacher is uh, Mr. Little, because he's the best. Shoutouts to you, Connor. All right. um, I'd say Mrs. Lupo, because she's super understanding, and she's super compassionate about her job. Um, Mr. Bovenkamp, because he's nice. Uh, Miss Snyder, because she's really, really funny, and she's super genuine, too. Uh, Mr. Perkins, he's awesome, because, like, he's got that sick beard. And like, I aspire to have a beard like that. Miss me, because she's just a great person and she really gives us some slack whenever we need to do things. Uh, Miss Rainwater. Probably Mr. Carlson, because he does the cross country and track. Uh, I would have to say either Mr. Finstrin or Mr. Martin. Uh, they're both just really chill and they make you feel at home in their classrooms. Uh, I would have to say um, Mr. Schneider, just because he teaches engineering design, and I've and I've taken that taken that class these past two years and loved it a lot. Um, I love Ganger. Ganger, he's the best. Just love him. The absolute best. Uh, if you want him, he's in 600s over there. Best driver's eye teacher. Amazing. Love him. Honestly, we could go on and on because the truth is, you all reach us in different ways. We may not always pay attention or follow your rules, but we want to say thank you, thank you. Thank you for sticking with us. For the long hours you put in. For listening to us. For supporting us. Thank you for reminding us to sanitize our hands. And reminding us to turn in our missing assignments. Thank you for being organized. For your creativity and passion. Thank you for helping us become better versions of ourselves. We may not always show it, but you mean everything to us. Thank you for being our teachers.
<laughs> Happy Cinco de Mayo, ladies and gents. Alright, so Monday is gonna be 55 degrees Fahrenheit. Tuesday is gonna be 56 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, Wednesday is gonna be 57 degrees Fahrenheit. Thursday is gonna be 55 degrees Fahrenheit. And so is Friday, which is gonna be 53 degrees Fahrenheit. That's it for a segment, Prime Back to the Studio. So we hope you have a beautiful blue day. And a wonderful teacher appreciation week, as well as a happy Cinco de Mayo.